Empat, lapan, dua. Hi Tina, I was just thinking about you. Honestly, I was, of course you show up because I was like, I was just thinking about how I missed Tina on the TikTok lives, and I was hoping to see you again because you said guess what, and I never heard what. I even guessed chicken butt. <laughs> How's everybody feeling? Hi everyone. Hi Ginger. Hi Kim. Hi. Who else we got here? Hi Kimbo. Hi Just Whiff. Casey, good to see you. Christina, hi. Hi, Stacy. <laughs> yeah, okay. I forgot. Oh, of course you do that. So uh, today what we're doing is personalized magic. So if you're open to the idea of receiving tonight, I would recommend to stick around. Hi, Sammy. Good to see you. Sammy, uh, the aura lady, is going to be first on the list because she made me some soul supper some soul soup that i am super stoked on like i don't know why like <laughs> see, i might even get emotional again like it was <laughs> ah it's just so it just makes my heart so happy because i know how much love goes into sammy's soup and uh and yeah because it's, it's lots of love that goes into it so i'm super stoked yeah you like the, the little contacts i figured i'd play a little bit i figured it would kind of look cool with the background but Uti, they got my soul soup. I'm super stoked. Um, so let me just put on the list real quick. Sammy. And then we'll open it up. Let's see, four. We can probably do seven or eight. We'll see. Uh, thanks, Jason. You the man. Thank you. I appreciate that. Just a reflection. What you see in me is what you see in you. Alright, let's see here. So let me change my... All right, so tonight, we're doing this one. Pop, pop, pop. Yep, so tonight we're doing 29, a minimum donation of 29 uh, to receive a personalized transmission. So um, what that means is we are going to be doing channeling healing, activations, upgrades, any combination of that. There's always going to be healing involved, but any combination of that as delegated by your highest self, your higher mind, um, and... Uh, for the highest good of all, of course. And yeah, so whatever comes through. So just a minimum donation and you will get put on the slot, but there's limited slots. Beautiful. Yeah, absolutely, Pat. Uh, you can always get upgrades though, too. <laughs> if you feel you're already perfectly healed, um, if you're already healed, that's, that's really dope. And uh, I think that's great. But if you ever want some extra upgrades, let me know. Uh, I do use Christ consciousness in my work. So Christic consciousness and architecture. So you might dig that. Um, what was I getting at? I forgot what I was going to say. Hi, Tess. How are you? Yeah. So anybody, anyway, if anybody is interested... I'm receiving a personalized transmission and there's always energetic spillover as well. So keep that in mind. Um, I highly recommend just to hang out. All right, I got you, Taylor. I would highly recommend just to hang out because there's a lot that can come through for people um, that, you yeah, for everybody. So it's like, uh, so I like, sorry, there's things coming in and I don't want to miss them. One second, because I'll get distracted. So Taylor, I got you. Holly, I got you. Ginger, I got you. And then Jack, Jacqueline, I got you. Did I say that already? Yeah. So we've got Sammy, Taylor, Holly, Ginger, Jacqueline. And I just need to make sure I associate your name with your username. So, okay, Tay Tay, awesome. Yay, I'm so excited. And then Holly. Who is the username Holly? Yeah, the username, the description box. What's what's what that's best for 
Uh, Stacy is the I can follow up afterwards if for some reason they, uh, you know, get cut off, the battery dies, something like that, or they, they fall asleep. Um, that is the best way. So I can get back to you through that. I don't know. Oh, my brain is going bye bye for a second. I don't know what's going on. Um, so who who is Holly? Who's the username associated with Holly that donated? Hi, Crystal's intentions. Oh, I'm already keeping up. Cynthia. I just need to make sure I get usernames. See, I don't want to switch because the screen because I'm afraid it'll freeze. Okay, so I got so I'm gonna be full for now. If something else comes in, um, that's okay, but I'm gonna take this off just in case, just because I think there's enough for today. I don't want to overdo it. Okay, boom, Cynthia, okay, Cindy, I got you, let's see. Oops, sorry. Holly, okay, perfect, Holly. Just want to make sure I get everybody right. Holly in. Got you. I got Ginger. Got Tay Tay. Um, Cynthia. We got you, Cindy. Okay. I don't know why it says host next to some people's names. Tutor da Pasia. Christina, I did get you. Yep. Thank you, Christina. And I got somebody else did, but I want to, yeah, I, I will get that person, but no more, please, just to be sure, because I want to make sure that you get me at my best and I don't overdo it. Okay, so I think I got, I just need Jacqueline. Just Jacqueline. Who is Jacqueline? Uh, Kimbo, is is that Jacqueline? Okay, gotcha, Kimberly. Yep, yours came in last. Okay, so that is, or the, the list is going to be full tonight. Thank you so much for donating, but stick around. But definitely stick around. Okay, I got you. Rising beautifully. Good to see you again. Pupura hatsa tiri hetindu kurkataya. And then Kimbo. Boom, 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 Spiritual girl, gotcha. All right, thank you for being patient with me through that process. Like my brain and my 3D brain and my speaking brain don't often go good together. So if there's something coming in that I'm like trying to process, like there's nothing here. Just I go bye bye. So <laughs> thank you for being patient with me um, and figuring that out. And just as a reminder for everybody that um, so what we're doing tonight is personalized transmissions. So healings, activations, upgrades, there's always going to be healing, but then what comes through for you may be deeper healing if it's needed, or it could be activations of, you know, whatever is appropriate for you. And then also upgrades can come through too as well. So it can be any combination of that, but healing is always involved. And it's going to go in the list in which I received the, the donations. So first is Sammy. Um, second is going to be Taylor. Third is Holly. Fourth is Ginger. Fifth is Jacqueline. Oops, okay, sixth, I did my numbers wrong. Sixth is Cynthia. Seventh is Christina. And eighth is Kimberly. And the, the list is closed for tonight. Um, but just stick around if you want to receive some healing tonight um, because there's always what we call like energetic spillover so what we're doing essentially is what i'm doing is i'm essentially writing and performing a healing song for one specific person that's in the room so it's like writing the lyrics um the music that's the right vibe that they vibe with they mesh with, with really well um 
and also like you know is it the you know the rhythm the genre that works really well for them their own personal healing song but that doesn't mean that everybody else in the room can't hear me perform that music right so you can use that music in this analogy in order to have shifts in your own energy field so you can set intentions um, but you can also just be open to receive and it's only going to come through for the highest good of course i did get you kimbo yep one second. Hold on, let me clear something real quick. I gotta ground a little bit. Tuchiara and the kini mentor mur katalok or yana. All right. So yeah, so what I was getting at essentially is that we're going to be doing some personalized transmissions, but there's always extra goodies for everyone. So I would highly recommend to stick around because uh, uh, there's always lots of awesome things uh, that can come through for people. I've had people have like awesome results. Like for example, if I was working on one person's knee, somebody else that's in the room, their knee is now better, which happens, you know, which is cool, which is why we do it. Um, but yeah, so just keep in mind that it's going to be in the order in which it was received. So if you're towards the end of the list and for whatever reason, maybe your phone dies or you get disconnected, you lose internet, um, you know, you fall asleep. That happens quite a lot because when you're at the end of, end of the list, you're going to be receiving quite a bit of energetic spillover up into the point that you receive your transmission. So um, that can really get to some people, pretty, can hit pretty, people pretty hard. Um, but just know that I'm going to follow up with you the best I can based on the information that you sent. But if not, for either either way, please reach out to me as well. And um, you can you can shoot me an email. You can follow up via the way that you donate, donated um, and or just leave a comment on the video and we will make sure that you get your transmission. But yeah, how's everybody feeling tonight? Where's everybody from? And then we'll get to Sammy here in a couple minutes. You know what? I'm going to go grab my other coconut water. I'm realizing I'm drinking espresso coconut water, which isn't going to help. I'm going to drink regular coconut water. Spazzy. Nothing new. Nothing new. Totally spazzy. Totally spazzy. <laughs> it's just sometimes hard to talk. Uh, yeah, so Heather, what we're doing is, is personalized transmission. So this is going to be for each person uniquely. I'm essentially writing a personalized song and uh, a healing song for that specific person, but there's always energetic spillover for those that are in the room. So stick around. You can use your own intentions to guide the energies towards an area of intention that you would like. So if you have a physical thing going on, I recommend when I'm doing the transmissions to just be in your own energy. You know, don't worry about what's going on in the chat. Um, and then just place all of your awareness in that intention. So if it's a physical thing, place all of your awareness in your knee, or if it's something you want to manifest, bring up that in your intentions and in your imagination. And that's a way to interface with it. So it can uh, assist greatly in that. But uh, Heather, uh, yeah, I've got you already. So if I didn't reach out to you already today, I think I did, or maybe I didn't. I'm pretty sure you should have got an email today, but if not, I'll follow up anyway after this and we will see. Um, We'll make sure that we get you get we get that for you. Sorry, I can't think today. One second. There's just lots of energy wanting to come through already.
Okay. All right. Sweet. So um, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to do a couple things for everybody that's in the group container. So if you're open to receive, what we're going to do is we're, we're going to establish a 12D diamond pillar as our foundation shield. And we'll add a couple extra layers to that. Um, and then we'll go ahead and, and trigger an automated like clearing process. So this is like an automated healing that goes through and it's going to be unique for each person, but it's going to help shift out energies that are not meant to be there any longer. So like stagnant energies, and it's going to help clean up the meridians. Um, it's going to vortex stuff out you don't need and perhaps bring stuff in that you do need. So it's going to be overseen by uh, your own personal counsel to make sure that you get what you need. Um, and then then we'll jump into the transmissions for each person. I will talk through exactly what I'm doing for the most part and uh, through the, like a bit of a protocol that I'll be doing for each person. And then after that, I will kind of like not mention as much through that part um, just to help accelerate the, the transmissions. I, I, I go, the transmissions are done to the energies. So it, I go and I stop when the energies uh, do so for me. So I start it and then I'll go until the energies stop as facilitated by your highest self. So uh, yeah, Karahi said, let's just get started because I'm ready to go. My solar plexus is like, woohoo, let's just like Randi ni nahansa na haukore ke rati rasi ro tu mutu parasati dasia. So if you're open to receive, just intend to do so. Ta isa ke mara tu sara yarki na mantore. So what we're going to do first is we're going to establish our 12D diamond pillar. So I'm going to fire up a six pointed crystal star a platinum silver frequency. It's gonna move from the pineal gland down through the central pillar, the Hara line, the pranic tube that houses the energy centers. It's gonna go by the throat, the high heart and heart, the solar plexus, cleansing as it goes down gently to the sacral, the roots. It's gonna go between the legs, between the feet, and then down about a foot below the feet at the Earth Star Energy Center. And it's gonna spin up at this spot faster and faster until it ejects a platform. And this platform is wide enough around so if you were to extend your arms outward, you wouldn't be able to touch the edges. And it's gonna to begin to emit a diamond platinum white light. It's going to rise up. It's gonna go through the feet, around the legs, through the legs, around the hands and arms, through the hands and arms, through the torso, the neck and throat, to the head and face. And it's gonna lift up about a meter above the head. So you can't quite touch the top of the pillar of this light. And then that six pointed star is gonna move up through the har line, through the legs, through all the energy centers, out of the body, all the way up to the top of this pillar and it's gonna spin again faster and faster until it ejects another platform. It's gonna vacuum seal us into this pillar. And then we're gonna add two extra layers to this. So we're gonna place a platinum octahedron that goes around that pillar. We're gonna rotate it gently clockwise. We're gonna ask for whatever frequencies and whatever light codes that are best for each individual uniquely to flow in. So whatever is best for you for tonight is going to begin to saturate through the walls and start to vortex gently around us in a clockwise direction. And then we're gonna breathe in these frequencies and these light codes. So we're gonna breathe them into every cell and every fiber through the head and the face, neck and throat, through the whole torso, all the vital organs, the hips and buttocks, down through the legs, through the feet, the shoulders, biceps, triceps, elbows, forearms, wrists, hands, fingers, and thumbs. And then we're going to open up the heart just with your own love frequency. We're going to put a truncated icosahedron a structure around it so it looks like a soccer ball. And on the sides, on the faces of this geometry, we are going to place chromium mirrors on the outside and we're going to place silver mirrors on the inside. Then we're going to expand your own love frequency, which is gonna expand this geometry so that it goes all the way around your field, whatever that looks like for you. So three, two, one, we lock that in. Now I'm gonna paint the seams with some light codes just to assist the structure to stay up a bit more and whatever else is needed for each person. All 
Awesome. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to establish my pillar of light. So I'm going to open up a portal to the Grand Central Sun, pull through just pure source consciousness down through our sun portal, and then down through my energy centers, through my crown, through all of my energy centers, out to my root, and down into the center of the earth. I'm going to connect specifically to uh, 7D Gaia, to her crystal core, and we're going to stay connected. We're going to bring this back up up through the rocks and the minerals, up through the root, through all of the energy centers, out through the crown and back up the source. And then I'm asking my highest self to step in and any aspects of myself that are specialists for anything that needs to come through today for anyone to step up. I'm gonna ask everybody else's highest self or higher mind to step in and any aspects and guides that are relevant for today to step up. And then I'll invite beings of the highest living eternal organic light only that would like to assist the higher selves in the intentions today through their transmissions or anything that comes through uh, to please do so with deep appreciation and love. Throughout all the work tonight, no harm will be done, no energy will be taken that is not freely given out of love, and it will be in alignment for the highest good of all only. So we're doing personalized transmissions today, um, whatever needs to come through as far as healing, activations, upgrades, and any combination of that for each individual. And hopefully lots of good energetic spillover for everybody that is in the group container as well. And we're just gonna ask for some extra assistance to help keep the group container as calm and cool as possible through those that are kind of flipping through and finding us on the For You or through the lives. <laughs> we know there's no coincidences, so we'll be a little bit tolerant. What I'm going to do as well is before I get started, after this next little part that I'm going to do that's going to be... Let me know. I feel like, I feel like it was frozen. I put my thing all the way down. Yeah, am I back? Let me know when I'm back. Okay, I'm back now. Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't know why it does that. So sometimes when people call, it freezes my thing. And I apologize. It like drops my, my connection. But what I'm going to do before I get started is I'm going to make the chat when I'm doing the transmissions for subscribers only. So if you're interested in contributing, 444, um, you can subscribe to this live and doing so we're going to have some other opportunities for people to subscribe like when we do group healings um, those that are subscribers will be able to get give their personalized intentions uh, that we can pick from when we do the group healings as well so uh, it's a great way to show energetic support like it has an energy exchange as well so um, thank you for to everyone that is subscribes because it definitely assists greatly um, not just you know like it just helps support and a lot of the, the heart that goes into this. So I deeply, deeply appreciate you. Um, but yeah, you can do that through, uh, I don't know how, I don't know where you do that. You can click it somewhere. But anyway, so what we're gonna do now is I'm going to do a trigger, an automated healing process, that go, a clearing process that can do all sorts of stuff, stuff. This could be just a healing all of its own. So if you're open to receive, just acknowledge that you're open to receive and relax. I'm gonna place my left hand on the back of your head, and my index finger and middle finger on the forehead, and then I'm just gonna trigger this. And I, I encourage those that are able to tune in to tune in at this time. Just see what comes through, you know, close your eyes, feel your body. If you're more of a feeler, just become hyper aware of how your body feels. If you're a seer, tune in, tune into what's coming through for you. So I'm placing my hand on the, the head, my index finger and middle finger on the forehead. I'm just gonna trigger this.
Awesome. So there we go. And we're going to start here in a second. So Sammy, hopefully you're still here. Awesome. Okay. Sammy is up first. And so just as a reminder, I'm going to be setting the chat to subscribers only just to help kind of control um, the trolls and, and those, the other people that can be quite distracting when we're doing this. Um, and when we're doing just other transmissions for the general public and such, or during Friday Night Lights, um, I will set that to not so much so people can actually chat. But since we're doing things that are for specific people, we're just gonna set that to um, subscribers only. So we will get back here in a moment. Um, for if, though, if those people that donated, don't worry about um, you know, being a subscriber. I will, afterwards I'll turn it back on so you can respond. Boop, <laughs> thanks, I forgot to do that, shoot. Um, I forgot how I do that one second. Yeah, settings, comment settings, set away. Okay, so it's gonna be subscribers only for a bit here. Okay. All right, Sammy, this is for you. Just relax. Um, feel free to set some intentions if you'd like. One second. What is going on? Am I laggy? Am I laggy? Is it better? Is it better? Okay, I think it's better. Okay, that looks better. All right, Sammy, I'm so excited to, to, to do you. Okay, I'll just confirm I'm back. Okay, cool. All right, Sammy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk through what I'm doing for each person, but I'm going to do a little bit more extensive speaking for this first recipient, So and then kind of rush through a little bit more for everybody else. So, so everybody that's receiving a transmission tonight just keep in mind this is what's going to be coming through for you as well so first what i'm going to do is connect with mother earth's heart i'm going to connect to her merkaba structure which is around her heart the top tetrahedron is a like a electric green color the bottom tetrahedron is a platinum color so this geometric structure is we're kind of like made of these tetrahedrons that kind of spin counter to each other that creates these vortices the vortexes so i'm going to connect to that bottom tetrahedron into magnetic frequency that i'm going to bring up through the rocks and the minerals up through my root and into my heart space it's going to continue to flow i'm going to connect to sirius or what people will call our father or spiritual star we're going to bring down a hot pink frequency a masculine and electric frequency down through my crown and into my heart where it's going to continue to flow for the transmission i'm going to place a code in the back of the recipient's heart then I'm going to open my heart and inject another frequency, a magenta frequency from my heart into this code and into the heart that's going to continue to flow. What this does is it brings frequencies from Alpha Centauri, from Lyra, from uh, Venus, and from Electra, which is in the Pleiades. This, these are like motivational energies, confidence, willpower, um, manifestation, and of course, healing. So that's going to continue to flow. I'm going to create a double of myself. He's going to place his hands on the front of the knees. And from his heart, he's going to release what we refer to as clearing pyramids. So they're like an old ancient Egyptian energetic technology. I'm going to go through in sets of two into the body up to eight of them and they're going to shuttle around and help transmute energy so he's going to leave his hands on there for six minutes then he'll draw those back and he'll dissolve i'm going to take out a little energetic thumb drive here place a code on it that entangles it with 16 different healing frequencies i'm going to plug that in and i'm going to ask that to run for the next hour for each person and that has frequencies for like self-love for perfect health uh, confidence willpower energy calmness abundance frequencies uh, it's got unity consciousness, dragon frequencies, dolphin frequency, dragon or uh, diamond frequencies, angel frequencies, you name it. It's got all sorts of good stuff. So that's going to go where it's necessary um, as appropriate for your highest good. And then we're going to trigger an infinity through the whole system here that's going to help accelerate healing. Good. 
be boss and yeah i'm gonna run that for an hour as well and i'm gonna use a little shortcut code so i'm gonna take out an electric blue cylinder i'm gonna place a code in it i'm gonna take that i'm gonna place it between the root and the sacral this is gonna go through an automated like column cleanse so it's gonna go through the upper energy centers all the way to the ones that are outside of the body all the way to the alpha transmission center then it's gonna make its way back down through the lower energy centers to the ones outside the body all the way to the omega transmission center and back up it's gonna be overseen by our Lyran family so Sam if you see a couple of blue beings that are here to help hold space and then I'm gonna use one more shortcut code so I'm gonna take out a gold sphere I'm gonna place a code in it I'm gonna place this in the heart space. This is another automated healing where you can guide it to a specific intention if you'd like. Otherwise, it's just gonna go where it's needed most. This is you uh, using Lumerian like healing frequencies. And then here we go. We're just gonna call in Libra into the hips. Sometimes there's not a lot of vocalizations. Sometimes they're not necessary. Doing a little work here in the lower back or the sacral area, kind of the whole base. Releasing. <laughs> and for those that are new to this, uh, yawning and burping are ways that I release energy. So I help the recipient release energy in that way, stuck energy. <laughs> Slower, guys, please. Come on, shadow dark, that see her. Lura Shura non tantia mehe chira crocur coasarke magnese matantaraki. Muchu tarsu na uraka na mamarke ariani. Lera tartia curco magiepo sahyasa to way of walk da para. Purocuri manatiri ke sira satoto de gutieri por shandarove adima. Le timar to sakia macrakia. Mule worta stura shatia racatur de sesia fanamam tuya. De tura nana. Tiada, 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 tiada. Kau sorang, tiada, tiada, tiada. Ia sakit, tiada. Kau 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 t
tutti perché per questo che per lasciare perché per quando si roti e poi per per se che ci ha scelto qui per tutti che dopo si muore la tara la tara che sta con cucù ma la tara di amor e tare scelta monte di massa le cucci ha scelto tutti e la papà era nata con tutti tutti era ma ma la papà è scelta molto ma la papà era tutti si che la tia tan 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 te lo cucù e clac 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 tu che pa morte a tare che non massa che proprio per cui e ma 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 non è mai tutto bello, posso dire, però che muore, da 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 che era, che da si, che non è, in, 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 lo randa nella turca da sera, be, be bra sara di re di sera, ma, di bua il mamma da ni be, be ua tam war tam, be berra na niara ka bara sia, lo e puccia bra sa ti e mani te gara yato viara, le carica da si, di di esse il motore da sia, da, porta su di ti ma zani e motu gara ha si la ti si, ua, Buah hatta mau butuh orang apa biar dia nak raya usia. Dia terah dia dah sani marah tak bukunya berapa biar kita memang bukunya berapa kita mesti berapa kita mesti berapa kita buat. Dia berapa kita mesti bukunya berapa biar kita mesti segera dia mesti kita sulit mesti bukunya berapa kita mesti berapa biar kita bukunya berapa kita berapa kita mesti kita berapa dia. Dia tu tu urut esas dia nak anda rasa dia sani tu kau yang bersia. Lu sorry mama rata saya hakir ya kita ni. Le kene ni mama rata saya aku faria bermuna. Le perang mengani aku bahaya kuru ya. Le rata rata hari tu tu orang ni ya. Ia biar manusia yang raka raki, ia di dia suruh tarik barja, lut atas asia rata di pukiman. Batu berapa hasa ratu firam mukera, ia rana ia ni nalar kau biar di dia. Ikan ikut suku cera keti prasa papi ar tu bumi kudu mana papi ar kerja sedulur nu tu bipa. Ia prasa papi ar hendak nasi dia dia. Ia rata rata dia ur tu 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 kira rata rata rata. Ia dia 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 rasa rata rata kita turun bermuka barik kita pegar kita bumi. Jipur kau mana boleh pegar kau terkau terbalik kau terima di kau siap buat yang berkuasa pegar kita terkau terima di kau terkau ada pegar apa apa kita musuh kita pegar siap terkau kita mesti ada yang mati. Ia rata rata kita hati ia rata rata suki nanti ia dia dia ni salah luar tu ni. Luara tu ni, nani pura di bawah harga ya. Lupa kau le mamuris dia di ni apa tarik ini. Kui ye tu mai urta ye pasar. Tara ta 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 ta. Kita kita ya lagi ta 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 ta. Kis, ni ngurut baru tu pasar ke pasarnya. Dia rak ya rak ini mah. Puji ucap suri rata nasi. Le para nasi nasi lo turga. Le rata dia buat pukul nama mukti. Teka dia tak putih tak rakin. La la lukut ibu salih lagi ni ni la kuti la 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 kuti la la kuti pisu la ni la kuti ada. Le le ini nale kita dah lakukan si perakut dia lah kita bersih dia. Nen tetap rasa sakit kurus ayah hati tapi kalau buat pun perutup at hantar 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 dia ram. Orang yang suka kerja kena. Le tadi mana masa dia perasa dia bahar ke. Bucah berita bayar kau tuan guru mana ya tada tada tada. Ye je yang tada ya tada 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 tada. Kipor dia sah tada 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 tada. Ye tada 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 tada. Oh betul 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 betul. Syukur ya tada 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 tada. Kipor kita perlu balik dia. Ye kerja kita kerja kita musuk dia perah tada 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 tada. Ye rak tada 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 tada. Perlu dia menurut tu ayah ok, perlu dia perlu tu pegar ke sini kan? Perlu dia tu mak ayah untuk dia pegar ke tu dia. Dia perlu tu ni perlu tu perlu mana sekali perlu tu mak ayah perlu dia mak ayah perlu perlu tu perlu dia perlu sekali perlu dia perlu buka tak ayah ke ibu ayah nak kata 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 ini 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 ayah kata 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 hari tu minggu tu hari Shania kata 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 ayah kata kata musuh kata 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 kerja mana perlu kata 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 ini lagi dia mak ayah sah, mak ayah sah tu sih mak ayah perlu tu perah ramai nansa ya tak kiri es, ye es nahas dia sangat, buat dia was dia orang tak semalam. Kerana kita sadar, kuar tiap hari dia muda pada bawah arch, perut tiap hari mengeri pada bersuh tiap hari membaya, puri asharah nanda rasmi. Lekun do masta tari tindak perut fiamma, bi pura sarya nanda rakatis, di kis tada sar tada nasiya do mora, urti mara tasar hari kira kis syarat tada mutu sare, ni jalan nasare kata raya dia ni, lekur syarat ni mutu tada nasiya. Lu tar ku saya mata anak parai itu dua awal ekaman ayah leku ini nami anak natur si rekta si as tak ikut juga tak 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 ini ekran tak 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 dia rekta tak dia bukan berkopi yang bapa hantar tak 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 tak
Awesome. Okay. Woo wee. Yeah. So that that's nice. I bet with the um, the settings different for the comments. All right. It's back. One second. Let me know how you're feeling when you're ready, Sammy. Take your time. <laughs> And make sure you're drinking water. If you're going to be hanging out, make sure you're drinking some water. It's going to help a lot. False tongues. This tongue is the legit tongue. The tongue. All tongue. All tongue. <laughs> yeah, let me know how you're feeling. Oh, thank you, Plaka. I appreciate you. Your nervous system. My nervous system thinks you're beautiful. Yeah, Sammy, let me know how things go with that. Um, there was a lot there um, and a lot's going to unpack over time as well. So, you know, as you know, be gentle with yourself, drink lots of water, especially over the next few days, because um, we can forget forget that we do like a transmission like this and what, what those effects can be, because we actually did quite a bit there for you. So I would love to hear feedback and um, I appreciate you so, so much. Uh, if you guys don't follow the Aura Lady yet, she's she's getting... She's getting her gears going because she's going to be making some awesome content and she really does. She's like one of the most amazing souls that I know. Um, she was a huge influence on my own uh, growth and my path, my healing journey. And I owe so much to her and her group, groups, group, doing group healings and exercises. And she hooked me up with some soul soup tonight. So I'm super stoked that I am going to get to... Uh, eat some of my favorite that oh, i love it so much so much good energy goes into that that soup oh, so i'm stoked let us know how you are sammy why do my ears get red or hot um probably an influx of energy as you're shifting things so for right now for example my, i'm feeling really hot as well so my ears my cheeks are really red um, compared to normal so the energies are, are a little intense right now so that can happen Ryan, I appreciate you giving your feedback. Uh, we weren't aware, so I'm so glad that you have contributed in that way um, to this conversation. <laughs> I'm glad that you get to define what is spiritual and what's not spiritual. Uh, to me, everything is spiritual. We're just spiritual beings having a physical experience. Yeah, man, a space wizard. Yeah, what, why not? I'm a dude. 
just a dude. Just a dude. Space Wizard just is more fun. So we don't take ourselves so seriously. <laughs> Doing magic. Do arakin in krasar. Bible is religious. Dimanto natura siam. Uh, spiritual and religious can connect, but they're not necessarily the same thing, I would say. Spirituality is about um, connecting with the divine within yourself and understanding more of who you are and what that means in the whole picture of the divine. Uh, religions are about keeping things in boxes, setting up rules, limitations, um, saying this is okay, this is not okay, this is right, that's not right. I'm familiar with the law of one. Hi, Corrine. I live in Washington State, so about an hour north of Seattle near Mount Vernon, Washington. All right, so here in a minute or so is going to be Tay Tay. Yay, Tay Tay's up next. I mean, there's nothing wrong with religion, right? We, I mean, like that would be pretty religious of me to say what is wrong or right. <laughs> like to say that, um, you know, having religious viewpoints is wrong. I, in, in my belief systems, people can do whatever they want and it's very valid. People can choose whatever reality they want. But the thing is, is if we're, we're assigning uh, limited beliefs to what we believe in. So a lot of times religions, the whole point is to say that certain things aren't possible. They, only ha they can only happen in these ways. Um, and that's just a negative or limiting belief. And when we do that, we're going to have those experiences. When we have definitions that are negative or limiting, we're going to see that play out in our belief systems. And our belief systems are what's going to be shown to us in our reality. It's going to be reflected back to us for us to see, asking us, do we prefer to, to see your reality like this? Or do you want to change the way that you perceive your reality? So um, I choose to not have limiting or negative beliefs, or I do my best. Um, I still, of course, do because I'm human, just like everybody else. So we're working through those those definitions and those belief systems. All right, so I'm excited for Te Tarasira. The swelling in your foot went down beautiful, Sammy. Yay! Congratulations, it should just be getting better and better too. So how did that We did, we worked a lot with like the low, the, the spine, the solar plexus down pretty much too, so. And just a reminder for those that are new or just popped in, um, I'm doing personalized transmissions for people. And so essentially what I'm doing is I'm writing writing and performing like a healing serenade for one specific person that's in the room, right? So the lyrics are specifically written for them in this analogy. The music is to their vibe. It's, you know, maybe it's, you know, dubstep or country or whatever it is. Um, in this analogy, I'm writing it specifically for that person. So it's going to be flavored just for that person. But that doesn't mean that everybody else in the room cannot hear me sing and perform that music, right? So I'm, I'm playing music for one person in this analogy. There's energy. There's, there's all these light codes that are available. There's this energetic spillover that people in, then, in this room, in this container, can then use for their own purposes, for their own healing. Um, so you feel free to, to just be open to receive. Um, only what's for your highest good is what I always intend, and that's all that comes through on my end. But always on your side, too, I would recommend to, to only take what's for your highest and greatest good and uh, you know, ask your, your, your highest guidance to, to help you with that. But <laughs> if, if you start busting out any of the songs my guides have taught me, I'm a freak. <laughs> Who knows? They, sometimes they make me sing, but I only channel aspects of myself. So they sound like they might sound like different like beings in different you know, languages, but they're all just different energetic expressions of myself. So kind of like wearing different hats, like different specialists will come through, sometimes just to express a certain energy. And it's kind of more like Morse code sometimes. You know, so a lot of it will be like, it might be a short sentence it sounds like a language but it's really like a connector to like extra data so it's like it's like a giving you an ip address that then you can go to this website to download stuff from so even just like a small phrase can can have a lot of data connected to that thank you stacy all right i'm excited 
Utu Antina. To Ara Um let's see. So hold on. So Katrina, how do we get you to do our song or reading? So this is personalized. Uh, we, I did the list is already full. So um, tonight we're already set up with a list of people. So sometimes I jump on and we'll do this in just kind of like random nights when I'm feeling good. So if you're interested in doing so, I would just like follow my channel and maybe I think you can set it to like get notified of lives or something and then um, just keep an eye out and then jump in when we do it. And I'm trying to set it so I kind of give a heads up. I gave a little bit of a heads up today, um, but not everybody sees that stuff, you know, through the, the live event settings thing. I don't know. I received the transmission in my pants. Dude, dope. That's fire, man. I, I usually cost extra, Freddy, so I'm, I'm glad you got the hookup, dude. <laughs> Wherever's for your highest good. If it's for your highest good, that, you know, that's a rock and roll place. All right, so just as a reminder, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be setting the comments for subscribers only. So if you're interested in commenting through the transmission, uh, subscribe to the channel. It's one way to show support for what we're doing and also another a great way to have an energetic exchange. So to kind of give back um, as you're receiving um, and uh, kind of ben benefits everybody. And there's going to be stuff that we're going to be offering more to subscribers and you get to use cool like little icons and I see your comments better. So if I see down, I'm, I always pr prioritize those that are subscribers when I'm answering questions and doing specific group healing intention. So you can give an intention when I'm doing group healings and I pick which one with the pendulum. So if you want as a subscriber and I see your, your mention, um, it could be something that's just specific to what you've got, you know, it could be tyanitis or something that I've got in my shoulder. And I'll be like, all right, tyanitis. Okay, we'll see. And then if it picks it, then we will do that transmission for that intention. All right. You ready to rock and roll, Tay Tay? And there's always energetic spillover too. So those that are hanging out, you can feel it. You feel free to feel it and, and receive in that way. So let's see. Oops. Uh oh. Did it again. I think it's funny when I do that. Blink, blink. I think it's. So funny. I tried to click the settings and I missed and then it did that. So I think it's funny. All right. Subscribers only. If I can click the button, right? These contacts are making my eyes feel dry. All right. Subscribers only for the transmission. So we're just going to reaffirm that no harm will be done. No energy will be taken that is not freely given out of love and it'll be in alignment for the highest good of all only. So uh, our intentions today for Tay Tay are healing, activations, upgrades, any combination of that for her highest good as delegated by her highest self. And of course, for the highest good of all only. So just reaffirming the connection to Mother Earth's heart, reaffirming the connection to Sirius, opening my heart, placing a code in your heart, ejecting a frequency from my heart into your heart, into this code that's gonna to continue to flow. We're going to release clearing pyramids into the knees for six minutes and plug in a thumb drive those healing frequencies it's going to run for an hour we're going to trigger an infinity 12 times it's going to help accelerate healing we'll run that for an hour as well use a shortcut code to help cleanse the column of light and then a shortcut code for any intention towards healing that you would like or just you know let it go to whatever is for your highest good and then we will rock and roll, Tete. Alright. Yay! The Taruko de Capera Kilink, Taratura, Master, a Tese, Atina, Kemo Hatan and Anni, Mati, Rakoto, Karen, Messia, Yaka, Yata, Lukorn, and Nia Marenia, Ikui, Luritiris, Darkumana, De Montana, Namurtia, Nicaraya, Eta, we fear a pushia, where I do. You can not a good idea, Ratupish, do Panta, Saria, Tati, Kraki, Mandura, Tanguruki. 
تجارب وتنبرة تعال عندك يا بوات من يعني يا رينا يكوني من وانا نار يا تاي شبتا يا تاي نطرة فأفكانا تاي نكي ميري تيرتو نطرة من بري من غير قدي بري ما يندو يا لو من غير ما يندوني بري قدي ناين يا جوا يا ما نعلاو لو رينا أنا نيجر مزارين كدوي ميسي يا أراني كوني ما ركوت الصوري عن قصي شن نطرو لو كارو نطرة تادي ركوت ببيرا يشو تورس تان يا ما تورا تاري أسيري لا راتر Draco Sarto passa a mangiare, ci grazia la tata tata di ala da uish, non c'è di ala sa tata di ala, l'urra sarà la mia, e c'è la tata di ala sarà, ura che a chi ama cara si aziana, e a chi ama cara si aziana, la curcia sa tata 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 di sia, shua, cuci mucro, da papi e gunami, su cura da rena, te fetro surta tata tata di draca di uremua, e crara ni ne 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 muri paria sa utra ka ne a shi e luku de pak ne kutuk e a ne ki kuku 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 yaki ne ki ngurte kutuk yaki lak tep umbe pak ane a klik muki a re kutuk 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 ne a kutuk kutuk o ye pua ta sa di na ne la ra sa sa nda ni ne ngung la e lau ra kuk la ra ki la ra tan 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 ni mo la le ke na wak la le Puri menyam murah bapa rati, daerah ni murah darah, murah darah, da 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 ada kim, daya daerah da 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 dia rata da 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 da, dia kerata tu tu dia kerata ramu darah tu kulit, dia ini lah kan kulit, dia lah ni nak kerja tak kena, tu aku, tak eh tak eh tak, tu aku 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 nak hirup tak pakai tangan. Confirm, confirm, move on. All right, Tay Tay, <laughs> yeah, let me know how you are feeling after that one. That was a doozy. So a lot of fun um, expressions came through during that one. 
Because sometimes, sometimes there's not a lot of different expressions or dialects that come through, but you had some cool dialects. Everyone have your boop written ready to go for when he does <laughs> boops. <laughs> well, I'm sure that'll come through eventually. <laughs> but yeah, let me know how you're feeling. Hi, Serene. How are you? How's your trip going? Ah, thank you. Hi, it's good to see you, Arena. And thank you for subscribing, everyone. Cherie, hi. Gortasine. Had a lot of releasings with that one. Good. I know I need to do the boop emoji. <laughs> I love it. Beautiful. Unbridled star seed oki. Yeah, be gentle with yourself. Make sure you're drinking water over the next few days because that's going to help tremendously. The cells are going to be vibrating quite a bit and purging. Beautiful, Tay Tay. Yeah, just be, be gentle with yourself. Feel free to, to jump off because <laughs> there's going to be more energy coming through. So um, if you can, you know, ground a little bit, whatever way works for you. Um, and, you know, drink some water and allow yourself to just kind of be there. Feeling blissed out and finger tingly right now. Beautiful, great signs. Lots, lots releasing. You're most welcome. Most welcome, Dean McMahon. Patina Sara Tuasara. And here in a second. So the the order now is the next next step is going to be Holly. Holly, are you in the house? And then it's going to be Ginger, and then Jacqueline, then Cynthia, and then Christina, and then Kimberly. So just keep in mind if you're further along the list, you are going to be receiving a lot. So make sure you're definitely drinking water over the next few days. And um, if for whatever reason you fall asleep, you, get, you have to go, something comes up, you get disconnected, um, I'm going to follow up with you the best I can to reach out to you and connect with you to make sure that you get your transmission um, or I can just send the donation back. But, um, and also uh, don't hesitate to reach out to me as well. So you can send me a message, you can email me, you can leave a comment on a video and uh, I'll follow up with the way that you donated of course, but just in case. So just know, you know you're, you're safe, that if you miss out for whatever reason that you will get your transmission so no worries thank you beth i appreciate you thank you for the energy exchange i appreciate that so much De definitely deeply appreciate energetic exchange it means a lot to me thank you i say drink water i i would highly recommend coconut water um, or supplementing with electrolytes in some way um, or using shungite in your water as well to help the, make the water more bioavailable for you. But uh, electrolytes are going to help a lot, especially with this type of work. And also what I would recommend for people, but this stuff is like sold out. It's like on back order are these Bioplasma brand or Highlands brand Bioplasma cell salts. So there's 12 different cell salts in here. So essentially um, the, the goodies that are necessary in order to help the cells run optimally. But yes, shungite's great. I mean, coconut water gets expensive, but it's great. It's, it's really, it hits, it hits home in a lot of different ways. So, all right. Uh, we're full today, Miss Bubbleheads. Um, but just follow the page and then you can uh, be notified when I go live. And I'll do this. I do this every once in a while. Um, I'm going to try to make it... Um, each time that I use like the event notification thing, like uh, create an event, but um, yeah, no promises. <laughs> Cause I'm gonna do it when I feel right. All right, so I saw that you're here, uh, Holly. So next up is gonna be Holly and then there'll be Ginger. The fly girl Enigma says theory. Our light language is a mix of galactic lang languages mixed with languages from our past lives. Yeah, and sometimes just there's there can be quite a v wide variety of expressions of light linguistics and light languages. Like some of them are just sound effects. There's very there's very much um, expressions of energy that aren't physical or have never you know that that exist in kind of a different. Uh, it's like they're different all, all together, but it translates through as like different sounds or languages, even though it's not, they don't even use that type of communication. It's just like these weird, you know, like translations into physical reality. The vocalizations get translated kind of weird. Even the ones that sound like languages, if we're in like a higher dimension, they, they usually sound quite different. They sound very interesting. Um, yes, yeah, future lives for sure as well. And what's going, and it's all happening here now anyway, right? All right, Holly. So just as a reminder for everyone, 
I am going to be putting it to subscriber only commenting when I do the transmissions. Um, if you are interested in all the goodies that come with being a subscriber, I highly recommend checking it out. Um, you get to have a cool little brat badge. You get to use some personalized emojis that are gonna be entangled with different um, functionalities. So I'm making some new glyphs and stuff. So you can use those in a different in a number of different ways. Um, there's gonna be times where it's gonna be subscriber only. There's times when I'm going to perhaps do a live that's only for subscribers. Um, subscribers always that I see them better, so I'm more likely to answer the questions, especially in priority. And what else? A bunch, all sorts of good stuff. So, and it's a great way to exchange energy. So, if you want to show your support, it's a great way to do that. You know, at a, at a low, a low cost. But it definitely shows me uh, that there's a lot of love, and that helps me out in a number of ways by subscribing. So, thank you. All right. So Holly is up next. All right. I'm gonna put it to subscriber only, and thank you to all that have subscribed. That will. <laughs> All right. Eating a program right now, right on. I love it. I love that. Shura da Vader. I love it, dude. So we're just reaffirming. Thank you, Fly Girl. Um, no harm will be done. No energy will be taken and is not freely given out of love and it will be in alignment for the highest good of all only. We're doing healing, the activations, upgrades, any combination of that as delegated by the highest mind, higher mind, the higher self, um, for the highest good, and the highest good of all only. Just reaffirming the connection to Mother Earth, reaffirming the connection to Sirius, placing the code in the heart, Injecting a frequency into the code. It's going to help with motivation, confidence, willpower, manifestation, healing. I'm going to release those clearing pyramids in there for six minutes. I'm going to plug in the thumb drive with the healing frequencies. Run that for an hour. We're going to trigger an infinity 12 times. Run that for an hour. We're going to do a column cleanse. Cut code, and then we give you that golden sphere with the healing frequencies. Place that in the heart. So feel free to guide that to a certain intention if you'd like. Otherwise, it's going to go where it's needed most. And then we're going to rock and roll. Just feel your body. Don't worry about watching me. If people that are open to receive, just feel. You may see visions. You may see stuff like feel th interesting things in your bodies. Observe what's going on within you. Lukuchista nina kierati klektu kletto nama mutjurkiti sarakuma krua waraki markahina nantiana mi watarda yaruturya namia kiri turda mia mia na kiri tahra era klakat nehia muoti rut arati masarkia waklaya luria waklaya ranas li muoti da titara nira kura kiara na li mua Tiri sia, lora tauru kurto, lukurto matia nari, 
super loud frequency.
Sure, confirm. Move on. Okay. I'm gonna go, uh, one sec. Whew. Oh, I have some more water here, actually. I ran out of coconut oil. I have some more water. Oh, lots of releasing. Definitely lots of releasing. All right, Holly, let us know how you're feeling when you're ready to come back around. Lots going on in the throat too. So things are things are gonna be shifting and moving for a bit here, Holly. So just be gentle with yourself. I would recommend just to go lie down if you can and just like sit with yourself. You might be releasing a lot yourself. I'm not sure if that's something that happened on your end as well, or just um, or if I'm just exclusively doing releasing for you, but usually you're gonna have it's gonna have some effect on you as well. So I would re recommend to uh, yeah, just drink lots of water over the next few days. And um, if you can get into nature or ground a little bit, that's gonna help for sure. Um, but just be gentle with yourself. My I a star man? Sure. I mean, just as much as anybody else. <laughs> I'm a star man. Oh man, I wish I could remember lyrics. Hi kitty. Cosmic wizard. Yeah, it's just a label. It's just words. Just human stuff. It doesn't. I, I'm labelless. I'm a wisp. <laughs> I am formless. I can. I can manifest into whatever I want. That's kind of one of my gifts, is I can turn into. I can manifest aspects of myself. Do I help with fibromyalgia? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, yeah, okay, well, hopefully it's uh, found you well, Holly. Yeah, no rush if you're not, um, you know, not feeling like responding. So I would love to hear feedback if you're still here or if you're passed out or something. <laughs> That's totally fine because you're probably going through some deep, deep healing. So just be gentle with yourself. Okay, there you go. Thank you. Glad the knee got worked on. I'm laying down, wore a blackout mask while you were in it. Okay, perfect. Yeah, yeah, just be gentle with yourself and allow yourself to rest. Um, and just like I mentioned, drink lots of water. Um, yeah, I would, I would probably, honestly, for you, I would probably make, just jump off the live and go focus on yourself for now because they might, the, more, more of the transmissions might be a little too much for you at this time just to, because there's a lot, there was a lot that we moved through there. How beautiful, Nicole Holy, welcome home. You're back, welcome home. Weird, this man made me burp. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, uh, you, it's actually your humanity made you burp. Well, you're either helping the, the recipient release or you were releasing on your own, which is awesome. Uh, what is light, light language? Light language, I like to refer to it as light linguistics but it's essentially a universal expression of energy in different ways. So it's like, it's like pure, it was like the first form of like communication. It's like universal communication. So it's not that it's necessarily like languages per se. So people call it light language. Um, the, the term language has a lot of baggage to it, right? Cause then we try to compare it to English or other human languages and um, that's very much left brains. So this type of language, these linguistics, because it can come out in different forms, um, is more about like in the, the right hemisphere part of the brain rather than the left hemisphere. So it's meant to be felt. It's more of a knowing. It's more of a feeling. And, and there's some complicated expressions of that. So I'm also playing my energy field like an instrument. So we've got these different energy centers that come up in like a scale, right? Just like red, orange, you know, just like music. So they come in a scale and I'm essentially playing these subtle frequencies, the subtle energy bodies like an instrument and channeling energies through what we call light codes 
Light is information, light is data. So when we're saying light language or light linguistics, we're talking about an exchange of extra data. So that's why we'll call them transmissions because it's like creating packages of data that are outside of the physical, right? This is all in the energetics that then can be utilized by the recipient for whatever uses, right? So they're very multidimensional, like the movie, The Matrix. You see all that stuff in The Matrix. They're essentially referencing light codes. It's, if this uni if like our ex physical experience was like, a simulation, I would be like a coder. I would be able to, to manipulate the code, which is light, light is information. That's the, the, the platform in which we have these physical experiences and the way that we perceive things, that data. Um, I would be a, a coder for that. Does it work better in person? Not necessarily. I have some other abilities that I can use in person that I can't remotely. I'm just using my own electromagnetic field in order to make shifts in the recipients. But um, for the most part, no, it, it doesn't matter. This is, that's why we call it quantum healing as well, or quantum uh, architecture, because I specialize in energetic structures. So uh, sacred geometry would be another way to perceive it. So all this light is created from sound, right? Or it's created through geometry that then is light. So geometry is the form in which structure gets created through light that we then call a body or a energy field or, you know, even the energy centers or structures. But, all right, Ginger, you're up next. Uh, what's your thought on me always drawing light codes? I never knew until or, and I never knew I was until I met an energy healer. It's beautiful. You're probably this is probably right up your alley. There's not it's not a coincidence that I said, welcome home. I think this is stuff that you're already aware, well aware of. You're just remembering. Uh, I was my teacher. I've had many teachers. I, my experiences are my teachers. Um, I've had some amazing people. I, I see every single person that I interact with as a teacher. Every person that I've worked on has been one of my teachers. Every person that I've done a group, uh, been in group containers with has been one of my teachers. You know, um, I'm, I'm a school of the universe. The multiverse, or I'm a, I'm a student of the multiverse, rather. But great question, I like that. Tubachi Yamanatu, I don't know. All right, so Ginger is up next. So just as a reminder, what I'm doing tonight is I'm doing personalized transmissions for specific people. They got put on a list. Um, so it's like I'm essentially writing and performing a healing song that's specific to that person. So it's to the vibe of the music they like, it's got the lyrics that are appropriate for them that hit them in the, the, the feelers. Um, but that doesn't mean that everybody else in the room doesn't hear the music and can't dance to it if they want to or have an emotional response. They can use that data, that light, that excess light and, and emulate it in themselves and create shifts within themselves. I'm honestly not really doing anything. I mean, I am, but what I'm doing is I'm setting up an experience as a catalyst through an experience that you've designed for yourself so you shift on your own. So I'm giving you the, the memory in order for you to shift these things within yourself and activate yourself and heal yourself. So it's like a permission slip. I'm a permission slip in order for you to have these experiences, which is a huge honor in order to do. But, um, but yeah, so you use it, use it. You know, feel free to use your intentions and see what comes through. I would recommend just to relax and observe. You don't need to watch what I do for it to work. Just feel, um, you may see visions, you may see stuff. Um, you may feel some interesting things going through your body. You may burp or yawn, um, sometimes even more, sometimes dry heat and stuff. Everybody's different. Um, as you're releasing these stagnant energies that don't need to be in the body anymore. Um, and that's gonna be unique for each person. But uh, when I do this transmission, I'm going to be putting the chat to subscribers only. So uh, just know that if you want to be part of the conversation during the transmissions, that that's the way to do so. And there's a lot of little other goodies with the chat as well. So, Pratia Sandati Kurika Sarta Miamotanima. All right, Ginger, you ready to rock and roll? Woohoo! I love it. I'm excited too. I saw that you you got a session coming up too. I love working with you. East Coast Girl, there's a link in my, um, there's a link. You can go to tie-el.com and then you can do, you can find the link in there for the invite. So we're just reaffirming, no harm will be done, no energy will be taken that is not freely given out of love, and it will be in alignment for the highest good of all only. Our intention for Ginger is whatever comes through for her for healing, activations, upgrades, any combination as delegated by her, her higher selves, and um, for her highest good and the highest good of all only. 
Pua Samaria. We're going to reaffirm the connection to Mother Earth, reaffirm the connection to Sirius, place the code in the heart, check the frequency from my heart into the code, which brings in frequencies from Alpha Centauri, from Lyra, from Electra, which is in the Pleiades, and from Venus, helping with confidence, motivation, willpower, manifestation, and of course, healing. We're going to release clearing pyramids into the knees that help transmute energy. It's going to be left there for six minutes and then drawn back. And we're going to take a little thumb drive that's energetically quantum entangled with a whole bunch of different healing frequencies. We're going to plug that in. That's going to run for an hour. We're going to trigger an infinity that goes through the whole body. This helps accelerate healing. So if you ever want to help accelerate healing, use infinities. And doing it a number of times will help it kind of like get more solidified. And then I always put like a timer on, I ask it to continue to, to run um, as for as long as I set that timer for, and that's gonna be an hour. Then I'm gonna use a shortcut code, which is a pre-designed pre kind of like set of functionalities. So I'm gonna take out this. Doo -doo -doo. The upload data, it's gonna go through a column cleanse. And then we use a sphere that I put, place a code in, place that in the heart, and that's uh, going towards any healing of your intention. And then we rock and roll with channel, channeling whatever comes through for Ginger. え、からやな。え、からやかとらくてやなな。君にてたきらきたことかやら。けなのま。いた、たたたきないや。リブラサリナナニナロコロコ。君にまらなにょ。しゅ。しゅ。しゅ。しゅ。コロケパ。So even light linguistics can sound like sound effects, like straight up, like just sound effects, like a cartoon. <laughs> it's because it's like manifesting another layer of manifestation into the physical. So when you're moving it, there's reasons why sound effects sound better. If you watch a movie without sound, it's kind of like, eh. It's got sound effects. It feels it feels different, right? It's important. Feels like you're getting upgrades. Energetic release for those that are curious. <laughs> Why is this weirdo with his eyes all white burping and <laughs> making weird sound effects and moving his hands all crazy? Yeah, Space Wizard. Because that's it. Space Wizard. あ、だ。ほら、ピンピン、ほら、ピンカット、ニモテリ、ボロッと、バック、ボロミ、バラ。ニモリポテ、ポンチ、ブルッ、ピンカット、ニモテリ、ボロッと、これ、ニモテリ
tu ya la le cuya re ganan ya tu ra e ra ya ra nano do ningura ya ta ra ta ra ti ki pura ta ko te mo ni ma ma ra ti ke re ko to ko to ko to ko to ko to mi wo de bu ha o ke wa na ni ko ro Confirm. Confirm. Move on. Okay. All right. You have to let us know how you're feeling when you're ready, Ginger. Take your time. No rush at all. All right. Good fun. Good fun. Good fun. Yeah. Good fun. All right. Yeah. Uh, you'll have to let me know how that goes, Ginger, because <laughs> it definitely felt like upgrades. Um, and then just as a heads up, next up is going to be Jacqueline, and then it'll be Cynthia, Christina, and then Kimberly. So Jacqueline, are you in the house? Uh, awesome. Glad that you found that um, amazing, both Beth and Monica. Yay. I spoke light language. I don't usually encoded right through that. Couldn't stop. Beautiful. I'm part of it. I love it. I need to light some incense. Yeah, go for it. Yeah, set your space. Hi, Caitlin. Hi. Thank you for subscribing. Powering up for sure. Beautiful. Ooh, oh, I just saw a bunch of That might have got me, too. Well, clearly, with, when I'm doing this stuff, I'm receiving, too. It's 555, of course. I just saw a bunch of light come through. I don't usually see like that. I just saw like light, just a whole bunch of light, like, like fog, like mist light. Could have been the contacts maybe, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna try to make up an excuse. All right, beautiful, rising beautifully. <laughs> Angie Rodriguez asked, why is it that I feel a connection and understand what you're saying? Because this stuff is universal. So all of us technically do. We can all feel this stuff. It's meant to be felt. Your soul understands. It's speaking, it's soul language. It's my soul language is speaking to your soul. It's like breath. Like we know the power of breath, but what about breath with vibration? That's linguistics, right? That's 
these are these sound effects and different what sound like different languages and dialects. So it's power. There's power behind it. We know how powerful our breath is. Um, but yeah, welcome home. I am doing individuals tonight, Caitlin. Yeah, Jenny, I would be surprised if you've seen everything, dude. If you think you've seen it all and this is all you're seeing, you got a long way to go, sister. <laughs> you sure do got a long way to go. Sure, a lot of more shit to see, that's for sure. Out of my theater, out of my. Out of my. What is a space wizard? A fancy label. <laughs> I'm an energy worker, essentially. So I'm like a wizard. It sound, I'm sad, what it sounds like. I, I am a wizard and I use the cosmos a lot in the work that I do. So I use a lot of cosmic bodies. Um, we get information and data from the stars. We get power energy from the planets um, and constellations or like collective consciousnesses. I mean, it's all kind of collective consciousness anyway, but they have different purposes and, and functionalities. Hey, well, welcome back. Can't hold coop. Welcome back. It's nice to meet you, Lucifer, Lucifer Centra, Chantra. <laughs> me trying to read. I, I just need to make a compilation of me trying to like articulate people's usernames and just... <laughs> <laughs> That's what I call Destiny 2 players. <laughs> Why not Warlock? I don't know. Why not? I like Sorcerer with S-O-U-R-S-E-R-Y. I'm all of it, man. Just like all of us. Like, labels are just limitations, but it's just it just sounds more fun. Space Wizard just sounds more fun, right? And it's not wrong. Do I ever feel bad for being a fraud? I don't know. Do you? Do you ever feel like a fraud? Because I sure feel like a fraud sometimes. Um, how does that make you feel? I'm curious about how, how does it make you feel? Because you're, you know, that's what I care about, bro. <laughs> yes, I have, Kuli. Pray to God. Absolutely. Who's to say any of us are separate from God, though? How does God express itself? How, how do your prayers get answered? Through physical action, right? And we each play a role in that. We're each a piece of the infinite puzzle. Just making shit up. Everything's made up, Big Daddy. Big Daddy. I love that you made your name that. It sounds super cool. <laughs> I just hope you're just like a really big dad and just a really great guy for your kids. That's what I hope. That's that's actually what I really I really truly hope that that's why. <laughs> All right, rising beautifully. You're up next. <laughs> so just a reminder. So as I. Um, do my next transmission. I'm going to be setting the comments to subscribers only. So if you're interested in being part of that conversation as I'm doing the transmission, that's a great way to show support and do an energetic exchange and get lots of other goodies and stuff. So um, if you're interested in that, I definitely check it out. First time watching, I'm hooked. <laughs> well, we're glad to have you. Yeah, I'm just wearing contacts. These are just purple contacts. Just kind of fun. Why, why be so serious? Why do we take? Why are we so serious? We need to enlighten up a little bit. Everybody is so damn serious all the time. Definitely need to play more. All right, so here we go. Jacqueline is up. All right, Jacqueline, just go ahead and relax. Make sure you're sitting down. That's one thing I forget to mention. You've received before, though, so you know what's up. So we're just going to reaffirm no harm will be done. No energy will be taken that is not freely given out of love, and it'll be in alignment for the highest good of all only. What we're doing today is healings, activations, upgrades, any combination of that um, as facilitated by the recipient's highest being and for the her highest good and the highest good of all only. So I'm just going to reaffirm my connection to Mother Earth around her heart. She's got a Merkaba structure. So these are two 
tetrahedrons that are superimposed over each other and that spin counter to each other at certain spin rates. We're going to connect to the bottom tetrahedron, which is a platinum magnetic frequency, a feminine frequency. I'm going to bring up through the rocks and the minerals, up through my root and into my heart that's going to continue to flow. It's like a negative, of, like, a, you know, a ground. Then I'm going to connect to Sirius, which is a masculine frequency. Pull down a hot pink frequency from there an electric frequency down through the crown and into the heart. So we've got the magnetic, we've got the electric, we've got the power, we've got the information. And then I'm going to place the code in the heart, reject the frequency from my heart into this code that activates the code and continues to flow love from my heart into the recipient. This connects with Alpha Centauri to Vague, or excuse me, to Lyra and to Electra and the Pleiades and also to Venus. This brings in certain frequencies that are good for manifestation, confidence, willpower, um, and of course, healing. So we're gonna release clearing pyramids, which is an old ancient Egyptian technology, an energetic healing tool that flows out from the heart in sets of two from a double I create. And these are gonna help transmute energy. Up to 12 of them are gonna go through the body for six minutes. They will be drawn back and the double will dissolve. You're gonna plug in a quantum entangled thumb drive with a bunch of healing frequencies. We plug that in, it's entangled with 16 different healing frequencies. We're going to trigger an infinity. This helps accelerate healing, accelerate the things that are moving through the system. Run that for 12 times for an hour. So both of those are gonna run for an hour. We're gonna use a short, shortcut code to cleanse the column. Up through the upper energy centers to the ones outside of the body, all the way to the alpha transmission center, down through the lower ones, through past the earth star and into the omega transmission center and back up, overseen by our Lyran family. And then we take out a gold sphere this in the heart and that's going towards whatever intention you'd like or your for your highest good whatever that is and then we're going to rock and roll so I wear a marnai. Something going on in the back of the solar plexus. It's pretty tight. I don't know if that's a me thing through the energies or that's a you thing. Oh, okay, not so hard. Wow.
Okay, interesting. No vocalizations came through for that one. Very interesting. Interesting. Okay, Kuranam Yandani Kuratar Tima. See how you're feeling. Let us know how you're doing when you're feeling back, Jacqueline. I gotta go grab some more water here in a second. <laughs> you want to know what's going through my brain? I mean, a lot is going through my brain. Technically, my brain. <laughs> That's what makes my eyes do weird stuff. Um, but uh, what, what am I thinking? It's usually related to um, what's going through. So, like, if there's a dialect coming through or I'm just kind of, like, observing what's happening. A lot, honestly, not a whole lot goes through my mind. Um, it's mostly, in, I'm more, mostly in a flow state. So, kind of not, not quite a... Um, disassociated state, but just, it's, it's hard to describe. My brain doesn't generally work like most people's anyway. Um, for example, I don't have like an inner monologue. I don't hear things in my mind. I don't um, visualize things. I don't see things in my mind's eye or anything like that. Um, so the way that I interface with spirit in general, just interface with my reality is a little bit different than most people's. Um, Coley asked, can I see how many chakras have been unlocked? Uh, there's countless energy centers. So it really depends. So yeah, if there's multidimensional energy centers and depending on who you are, you can have completely different ones and different layers of them. So we're essentially made up of energy centers. Well, at least what people refer to as chakras. Um, and they can be in all different places, you know, here, um, in the heart, these energy centers around us, there can be, we have other ones, we got we have multidimensional ones. Yeah. Uh, does the speed and intensity of the speech mean anything in particular? No, it's just a way of expressing the energies. So sometimes that's really intense, um, and sometimes it's a little more laid back. Oh no, Jill, I'm sorry. Uh, I can do that for you afterwards. I'll, I'll have to double check, but I will be jumping on again soon. You follow up via email. Just shoot me an email, Ty L Heels just my username at gmail.com and we'll make sure we get you. And especially if you already sent the donation, then I always follow up after I'm done to like reconcile what I um, did. So I will be sure to follow up with you. But yeah, thank you for mentioning that. Uh, I felt my left, my right side shift. I can feel you working on me. Felt pretty cool. Beautiful. Yeah, just remember that you had this session because it can be easy to forget. You're like, oh, I'm just going to do this thing on TikTok. This, this weirdo is doing some stuff on TikTok. Might, might as well try it, right? And um, you can be surprised when it, when it all comes crashing in sometimes because uh, things are going to be shifting and releasing and moving over the next 70 72 hours for each person that received just that one initial clearing process. So that, that the healing or the clearing that I did for everybody in the beginning, just from that part alone, you're going to be shifting and, and, and healing in different ways. But uh, just keep in mind, there's integration process. It's like, it's like a computer program. You're uninstalling old programs that are no longer serving you and you're installing new ones. And sometimes the computer's got to reboot. So if you rest really hard, be sure, or I mean, if you're really tired or whatever, make sure that you honor your body. Um, drink lots of water and get some nature if you can, or at least some grounding. That'll help a lot. And feel free to hit me up if, if integration gets a little too intense and stuff. Feel free to, to leave me a comment or shoot me an email. All right. Uh, Revelyn Lily asked, how did you learn and find out about this? And how do you know it works? Just generally curious. curious. I've worked on hundreds of people. I mean, thousands of people probably. Um, I honestly haven't had an experience where people said it didn't work. I haven't had anybody say that, it, that they didn't have an experience or it didn't work. So just from working on hundreds of people, that alone, um, and then also lots of, lots, I mean, I've worked through, through TikTok for thousands and thousands of people, and I've got so many comments, people follow up all the time. I do this stuff in person, so I offer donation-based transmissions in person at the local metaphysical fairs, and people come up and try it that way, and they, it's the first time with energy work, and they always have a profound experience, and I can feel it. 
Like there's there's not a single doubt in my mind that the energies are, are being transmitted. I feel absolutely everything. I mean, it moves my body. It makes me look possessed, right? You know, it's that strong. The energies are moving through my body that strong that it physically moves my body and my eyes. So there's no doubt in my mind because it, when it stops, it stops. When I, I, I touch on certain parts of the, the body and the energy field, I feel it. Um, I can entangle with people. I can feel, I can get the information through that way. So it's just a lot, a lot of different experiences have, have kind of set that up. How did I find out about it? Through my own healing journey. So healing things from this life, you start to heal things from other quantum realities. And part of that process is reintegrating those those soul pieces, pieces of who you are. When you integrate more and more pieces of who you are, it comes with understandings. And part of these understandings, or people call them abilities or gifts, it, they're just understandings, it's remembrances. Um, once those get triggered, they can come with things like this. It can come with speaking weird, what sounds funny stuff, and moving fingers funny. And this is part of what I do for other people as well. I activate people. I'm located in Washington State. All right, Cynthia, is Cynthia in the house? Cynthia is up next. I do have the best job in the world, Carla. Honestly, I, I didn't know growing up that wizard was even an option. <laughs> like, I remember, like, growing up and being like, God, oh, what am I going to do? I'm like, okay, I guess I can play football and basketball. I was pretty good at that. And I was like, okay, well, that's easy. Or I can be, I was going to be in federal law enforcement. I ended up working in marketing, but I didn't know that wizard was an option when you're a kid. I would have picked wizard right off the bat. If somebody would have told me you get to be a wizard, I'd be like, fuck yeah. That'd be dope. Did Cynthia say yes? Cynthia in the house. Uh, some, if somebody's asking about addiction, I do assist with that. It's, it, it's yeah. So just feel free to in, uh, email me. All right, perfect, Cynthia. Awesome. You are up next. You live in Pullman. Oh, you at college? Are you up at WSU or working over there? Uh, the miracle. I'm a wizard. <laughs> I'm a wizard. I'm, I'm an all around wizard. I am a, what would be considered a multi-dimensional wizard, <laughs> extra dimensional wizard. <laughs> wizard is just a uh, human term. It's just, I don't know. I do all sorts of stuff. I'm an energy worker. So we do magic here. Brrr. Oh, no, just there. Oh, beautiful. How do I know if I received any upgrades in my personal transmission? Um, you're going to feel it. You're going to have that experience. Uh, I, sometimes it's relevant for me to mention it. Um, sometimes it's not. Uh, but you'll, you'll know, you'll know, because, yeah, because what else, is there anything else? They're just saying, you know, you'll know. Um, so if you, have, like, sometimes people won't see with their third eye, and, that, and then their third eye will turn on. Or you start to move your hands automatically, um, or, you know, you just feel way more open and expansive. You may feel more intensely. If you're already a feeler, you may feel more intensely. If you're a seer, you're going to see more stuff. You might see more depth. Um, you're going to know. You're going yeah, to experience it. But we can also upgrade your energy set, uh, systems too. So you can, we can do upgrades all over the place. And technically, when we're doing healing, it's technically an upgrade no matter what. In, in a lot of ways, because we're, we're reconciling a broken pieces of us, if you want to consider it that, that we're reconciling that and bringing it back. And through the struggles that we had missing that part of us, that is growing our soul's journey and that's making us stronger. So when we heal from whatever we are bringing back into us, it's automatically an upgrade. You were already upgrading because you went through the healing process. So, all right, Cynthia is next, and then it's going to be Christina and then Kimberly. Okay, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to grab some more liquids. Grab your waters. Make sure you got some water. And they put the stickers right on the freaking mouth thing. It's like, why you gotta put it on the little thing? Like, why you gotta put it right there? Like, in all the spots, you gotta put it right where I'm putting my mouth. Sticky ass garbage. <laughs> and just a shout out to my amazing moderators. I appreciate you so much. No boop yet. <laughs> the voice was starting to come through, but they didn't boop me. Um, amazing shout, shout out to my amazing moderators thank you so much um, beautiful human beings that assist big time because obviously i got a lot of you know what i do is super weird <laughs> so there's a lot of flies there's a lot there's a lot of stink you know sometimes as people come through um their frequency is a little um harsh sometimes but yeah i'm near mount vernon 
Myra, and I will be at Mystical Wares in Mount Vernon, Washington this weekend, Saturday and Sunday, doing uh, donation-based transmissions for people. So if you want to get it in person, it's just a donation, whatever you feel is appropriate for you, um, and you can donate after. Um, and uh, I'm also going to be doing a class at Mystical Wares on the 11th. So I will be doing a, a class about light linguistics, light languages, and we'll be doing group activations if people are ready for their light language activations and talking about all the different ways of expressing light linguistics and light languages. So I'm going to try to stream it on TikTok or at least record it or something and then post it. So if you miss it, you can watch it. It's free. It's all free. Am I a Reiki master? No, no. I am attuned to Reiki, but I'm not a Reiki master. Nope. Did not go through the process. All right, and just another reminder, um, when I'm doing the transmission, the uh, commenting is only for subscribers, so a great way to show support if you're finding this um, live valuable or you find my work valuable, a great way to show an energetic exchange and so show support is to subscribe. Um, and also, if you feel uh, you want to subscribe, you, you'll get benefits, so like you get to um, Get comments only certain times we're going to do lives that are just for those recipients um you get to pick intentions and when we do group healings you can throw out intentions and stuff like that thank you monica i saw that i appreciate you i appreciate you thank you for that all right yeah well welcome miracle ask questions like like dude like i'm i'm all about questions Oh, thank you, Irene. I appreciate you so much. Um, ask questions. I mean, after this, um, the, I do lives where I just answer questions, but today we're doing some transmissions. So here we go. All right. It's Cynthia, right? I already crossed out Cynthia. Is it Cynthia? Yeah, it's Cynthia. Uh, no, the list full tonight, Caitlin. I'm sorry. Okay, that is. Okay, I already crossed it out. I usually don't cross it out until I'm done. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. All right. Kutuwara nanaria nukura. I'm going to have to take a tiny break the next one and ground a little bit more. <laughs> Let me just double check. Make sure I'm still going. Okay. Okay. Tuurandia rakia sarakia namusarata. All right. So, for Cynthia. Um, we're just reaffirming that no harm will be done, no energy will be taken, that is not freely given out of love, and it will be in alignment for the highest good of all only. What we're doing today is healing the activations, upgrades, any combination of that, that's appropriate for her for her highest good, as delegated by her highest self, for her highest good and the highest good of all only. Reaffirming your connection to Mother Earth's heart, that magnetic frequency, connecting to that electric frequency from Sirius, placing the code on the heart. Opening my heart, ejecting a frequency into the code and into the heart. We're going to release clearing pyramids into the knees. Take the thumb drive, plug that in, run that for an hour. And then we're going to trigger infinity. We're going to run that for an hour as well. Do a column cleanse. And then a healing code that you can guide to a specific intention if you'd like. Otherwise, it's going to go towards what is needed most. All right. And then we rock and roll. All right, Cynthia. Shut up. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.
Purging from the heart, uh, definitely the physical heart as well. Kuri mandal takia makuja. Tiedätkö, että 
Somatic release. Here, the hips are shaking, convulsing. Okay. All right. La da 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 ni kurta ramana. All right. Have to let us know how you're feeling when you're ready to come back around, Cynthia. No rush. Ki prata ni me ka rani muhatta ni ma. Hi, rock solid. Rati ni kura. Hi, Marvin. <laughs> Thank you for the rose. Maratani. Sweet girl, we call it light linguistics, light languages. It's more like a universal way of expressing energy in different ways. So um, it's not that it's, that it, it, I, I, we call it light language, but it's technically, it's, it's more like music than it is a language in a lot of ways, or it's more like code. Uh, we're doing specific intention, or we're doing specific transmissions for specific people, um, Marvin, but you are welcome to hold an intention while you hang out. And a lot of times, the energies that the energetic spill over these these light codes, light as information, light as data, um, can be used in many ways. They're multidimensional. Your your hip has been improved. Beautiful. Yeah, I could feel it. Yeah, there's some there's some ten, intensity going on there with Cindy. So um, there's we we did quite a bit there. So I would love to hear feedback over time on how you are doing, um, you know, in a couple days, because you should just be feeling better and better, honestly. And sometimes it takes a little bit for the ego structure, the ego mind to kind of get what has happened. So um, just give it some time and, and then let me know how things are going, um, because I would love to hear feedback. There was lots around the hips, the, the hips for sure. So the, definitely the hips. Um, I've definitely felt that we removed, we did something through the whole spinal column. So there's something really intense that came through the spinal column. Um, and just the like not number of spots, the neck. Yeah. It's hard to say because I, I often have stuff in my neck as well. So I, there was a lot moving through. It was really, it was really intense. So just give it, give it some time, be gentle with yourself. Be sure you drink lots of water over the next few days. Am I in pain when I do this? And what is the, what is that you're doing for this person? Uh, being Myra, I am, do I feel the pain? I, not, not the way that they do. So when we're disconnected from the, the ego structure, like if it's not our pain, it feels different. So I can feel it, but it's not as intense. So it's more of like a knowing as well. So even though like when I feel it too, my face and stuff will grimace, my eyes will do these things, that's also channeled too at the same time. So it's like, I'm not in that much pain. It's like, I can't keep my eyes from doing it because of the energies. So it's not that I'm like writhing in pain. It's that I'm like, the energies are literally like squeezed. Like there's so much voltage that it, it makes this happen. You know, like part, like everything is part of the channel. So everything is a little, a little different controller on a video game system to help with healing the person. So, um, yeah. I hope that made sense. You can put in the intention, Judy. Absolutely. You can do that. I would be part of the process. Use your imagination. Um, see light going into that area of your body when I do this next transmission. Hi, Sandy. Do I only heal physical pain? No, actually, I mean, healing is a huge part of upgrading ourselves. Um, so really, I'm these these light codes the way that i do things can be used for anything so any intention manifestation of anything intention towards anything um but what's really helpful right now is us healing and i know what it's like 
to have physical pain. I know what it's like to have physical issues. And I know how debilitating that can be and how hard it is to just be a human when you're always in pain. So I love to work on physical stuff. I love to work on pain. And I love to work on it as well because you get immediate results. You, you get to see the results, right? Somebody knows if they're, if they're at a 10 out of 10 pain like every day and it goes down to a five, you know it, right? So there, it's, it's doing these type of things is a great way to get like direct feedback um, and see things happen. And really we're, going, we're not just treating the pain, we're treating the, the wound that's creating the pain. And that usually will reconcile the pain because the pain is just a message. It's, it's a communication by the body that says, hey, pay attention to this. Look here, look here, look here. Listen to this, listen to this. And a lot of times we'll push away pain because we associate it as something negative when in reality it's trying to help us out. And if we sit and we listen to it as deeply as we can without trying to get rid of it and feeling it as deeply as possible and adding some extra little goodies, we can shift um, a lot of physical stuff. Because by the time it's physical, it's, it's, it's been an emotional issue. It's been a metaphysical issue long enough that it's crystallized into the physical experience as dis-ease in the energy flow. Trapped emotions, emotions, energy and motion. So when we're not processing those negative emotions, they get stored in the body and enough of those of the similar frequency get stored in the same area, enough it starts to create dis-ease, like, a, like a, a plugged up drain or like a like a creek that has different pools and you drain you get it clogged up upstream that's going to get all nasty downstream right or it's going to get all nasty where wherever it's at if the flow if the flow is not going so this is really just about reestablishing the flow so the body can do what it needs to do and bringing in light codes light is information in order to help that happen in an extended uh speed like a faster speed is that speaking in tongues? Uh, tongues can be considered a, a flavor of light linguistics, a light language. Tongues is most often associated with religions though. And the thing about religions is that they're, they're, light is information, light is data. So when we talk about light linguistics, we're talking about that transfer of information, ex extra information. So when, we're, when people in religious sects or whatever, however, whatever it's most associated with usually, are usually about having things in containers like uh, for example, you know, like this is right. There's usually limitations. The box is limited. They're, they're pulling from a limited supply of data of, of the, the recipes that they're cooking with. They've only got so many recipes, so, so many ingredients where I'm pulling from. I'm pulling directly from all that is. And there's countless ingredients that I can pull from. And uh, it's all from the love shelf. Oh no, Marvin. Uh, yeah, 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 Marvin. No, no problem. Copy and paste and send me an email. Uh, my username at Gmail. Go to the, the link in my bio. You can reach out to me in that way. And I'd be happy to see what I can do. My sincere condolences. Alpha. Um, if you're if you're interested in a private session, you can go to that thing in my bio that you click on that everybody talks about. Go there, and you can send me a message, or you can book directly through there as well. But feel free to s shoot me a message, and if you have any questions, or um, sometimes you know it's not even necessary to book a session. You know, I'm happy to answer questions, and I'm also uh, uh, what was I going to say? Answer questions. And, oh, and a lot of videos that I have can be beneficial to people. So you can, the transmissions I've already designed can, can be really helpful for people more than they would expect if they do it to a certain regimen. All right. How did I get into this? I struggled with a pretty shitty diagnosis with physical stuff and got really depressed and, you know, was told that I, what I had was incurable and was going to be terminal and went through all Western medicine to try to figure out how to, to get help. And they pretty much said, you're screwed and just offered me a bunch of medications and I didn't want them anymore. And so I got really, really depressed and you know, where that goes, went through that phase. Um, and then like a really bad phase, you know, like not wanting to be here and lots of all that stuff, like check, try and check out. And then you found, I eventually found energy work and healing. Um, and through that, this stuff naturally was activated within me. And then I had to learn to understand it because <laughs> it's, it's strange. So I spent a lot of time studying, a lot of time just practicing before I started to share it. But yeah. All right. So Christina, is Christina in the house? Christina is up next. Uh, does the person on the other end have to believe for this to actually work? No, not at all. 
Nope, that's a misconception. I mean, in some way, technically, it's up. It's not necessarily belief because by the time that they're interacting with it and they're, they're receiving, it's already they're already in the reality in which it exists. So the, at a soul level, they're already kind of agreeing that they believe in it. Otherwise, they wouldn't even be interested in getting a transmission from me. Um, so, yeah, it it doesn't make a difference. And my belief can outpower people's negative beliefs. My positive belief can do so. And because we're having that experience together. So it's not necessary. No, it definitely helps. The, the recipient is always the one that's doing the, it's, it's on their end anyway. So, but people can block it if they want to, if they don't want it, you can definitely do it. You know, that's up to the person. They don't have to do it. I don't send it to people that don't want it. All right. Did I, did, did we have Christina? Is Christina still here? I'm sorry. Oops. Okay. There you are. Is that right? Yeah, okay, that's the right one. It's a long. Okay. Boom, I'm not All right, sister. And then last up will be Kim, Kimbo. Is Kimbo still here too? I won't be coming back on tonight, no. Can I remove blockages? Absolutely, yep. Yeah. I'm still healing, by the way, um, Susan. I'm not healed. I'm still healing. It's just what they, all the, the stuff that they said is, you know, not true, you know. Um, I'm healing. I'm still healing. I still experience pain and that's how I know this stuff works because I work on myself <laughs> like I if I didn't discover energy healing work I wouldn't be I wouldn't be here there's no way um, I'd just be in too much pain so this it's a way for me to manage and that's because I've had so much physical pain I've learned a lot of different tricks I continued to search and search and search try more things and okay this didn't work all the way I can feel it but this didn't work all the way okay maybe I've, I've tried everything and, and through that you know, I, I, I was getting frustrated, but now I realize why. It's because I can share the tools that I've learned over time that they did work for me. They just didn't work to the extent of how I wanted it to, but it can still, there's reasons. I understand why I've got what I've got and I'm going through what I go through, but it doesn't mean that I'm not going to try to heal it. I'm still going to be trying to heal it. I'm still healing. You know, I'm going to heal it. I'm going to heal it. I ain't, I ain't going to deal with this sh my whole life. No way, Jose. But some, sometimes we have complicated issues. Sometimes it's complicated. <laughs> Spent thousands and thousands of hours on myself, working on myself. I've had probably hundreds of hours of other people working on me. Thousands of dollars invested in it. But it's all been beneficial. All been beneficial. All right. So just as a reminder, I'm setting it to subscribers only in the chat. So when I'm doing a transmission, it's only subscribers. So if you're interested in showing support and giving an energetic exchange, subscribing is a great way to do that. And you get little perks like being able to comment and, and share what intentions you would like me to use in group uh, healing sessions. So I do those quite a bit. And uh, yeah, so you can set those intentions. Will your dog receive any of this if she's next to me? Probably, if she's open to it, if she wants to. There can definitely be energetic spillover. She's going to feel your energy, so yeah. Uh, Marvin, I would just go with an organic session. Yeah, or even a straight-to-business one, depending if you don't have a ton of time to invest into it uh, or you don't want to invest in the resources. Um, we can do a lot in 30 minutes, but I would recommend an organic session for you. You're most welcome. All right, subscriber only chat. Sorry, I love you. I'll be done here in a bit and I can answer questions. Almost done. Two more. All right. Dura Randy Arke. All right, Christina. Yeehaw. So cool. Just make sure you're sitting down. <laughs> and remember, you don't have to watch me. Um, I recommend to relax. Be, be within yourself, you know, allow yourself to feel, be part, you know, experience it, you know, feel, feel, feel. That's, that's key. Feeling is healing. So we're just reaffirming no harm will be done. No energy will be taken. It's not freely given out of love and it will be in alignment for the highest good of all only. Today we're doing healing, activations, upgrades, any combination of that as delegated by the highest self or highest good and the highest good of all only. We're going to reaffirm the connection to Mother Earth, to Sirius, place the code in the heart, activate the code, release clearing pyramids for six minutes, thumb drive, figure eight. for an hour, Kurkimasa. Uh, calm cleanse. And then the healing sphere. 
and I've got a key, a key, and a Saturday, yes, sir. All right, and here we go. Mm -hmm. For those that are interested in, in receiving, there's always energetic spillover. So observe how your body feels. Set intentions if you like and observe. Observe what happens. Get curious. That's where the magic happens. Some work here on the third eye or the, the whole brain, the biocomputer. Aries into the head and face. I want to ask Ophiuchus to flow into the nervous system. Siam berdo tarna nanti, kurdo arasa nanti artu kui. Kita kita kaya nak kita kaya rakin ni ana, tekele ana kena kuro kena ikan ni ana. Turu tu ati de, de de mau, de de sara, kile ni ni ana, de de rak kuro kui. Kita berani de asu ni mana ana nak kita kuti pada kita rumah siapa berdaya ana. Orang kalau kuri mana sakhi raki si, lah kar ke si na sakhi de tesi. Jua rasa nanti rasa raki ana. It's been a lot of hip stuff with people today. Kita ingu shall ek de beri simbol tu pasal si. Jus dia yang rata dia suar nama aku rebut dia rasanya, ada ada lagi si titi ada 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 kira mana? Bukan kalau Libra ni dah hebat sangat, kalau dah ulir dia cuma kerja bawa kuki arah siapa? Purtian ni 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 nak tu kudi rasa, ura rani ni maranya, mau rutu orang ni merta ada 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 suar ke dalam dia ada mimi, purtiu si mers askerannya, lukuro awar wamana, beya mana mana meja mana tu kini mana? Liku li arah tasur ke beras dia. Di mar ta 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 ki di 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 dosa raya ta 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 ta. Di nugu li ema. Di mi ema nama mo turu. Arres teh karya. U arah nama ante nena. Liku li arah tas sema. Working a lot on the lower area, so like the root area and pelvic area. Then much down the hips. Ishi ni mani ni ya. Kuru kura sara bubar ni mama mukrasi. Store a lot in this area. Kurunan di mana nak tuhuri? Luku dah nanti tuhuri. Marti pasade tu kuriyan. Urti berasa tadi kare kan luku di berada antara kesat tadi. Yes. Look at lower back or sacral area. Ulo masana. Guerra.
Yotan tim rutu sarkan tikrayar daran dur ke mur na mara hayara larkur katar shen dera sarkan ande turtu libura panjang ke ne kurta bartung ne ferasira nante rati karikara ore mun ke mo harat pa faraku lur tu fesh daran ne marata yakite ne kra 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 ne hete tete tete yakia ronda rati su sur ne mare Nimbu antamam bibi anna bibi amba u ke pakra lakta sa lilete nimesi si rutarta su kre pandi me aturko pe perotu se pire siana raku ki se siena si pras faso pe furu ki pe anam nakran ke kra ke kia su kwarta sama. All right, let us know how you're feeling. All right, you have to let us know how you're feeling, sister. I'm gonna be doing a lot more. Uh, don't worry, moderators. <laughs> it definitely, it definitely helps. Ki marta ti kratha yaranu matare mayara. Biti 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 vima hati si tu te tu char ta ti engana na. Yeah, that was that was a bit good at the end there. Release, release, release. I should LOL. <laughs> Done. I asked Laya. Arigiada. Oh wait, <laughs> I read that as you should LOL. <laughs> no, I did. Oh God, I just, I know, now I get what you mean. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. yeah, Christina, yeah, there's some stuff going on. Th Actually, let me do one more thing. I'm gonna plug it in. Is it your right hip or just, or is it both of them? Because def we definitely did worked more on the right hip. So I'm just gonna plug in some frequency specifically into there. We'll do the other one too, why not? Alright. Kapuke na kiaranta tira. Ku arta sandu barkata. Awesome. Yeah, keep me updated, Christina. I would love to hear feedback. 
I, I would love to intergalactic Jessica. Yeah, <laughs> that happens, Sherry. I get you know, I'm, I get used to it. You know, eventually I build, I build anything up. Her not learning to speak better, but I'm building up some stamina, I guess. <laughs> What's crazy? I'll do, I'll do a full day of transmissions at the fairs. So this Saturday and Sunday. Um, I'm going to, well, it's probably is going to have snow, so there probably won't be too many people, but I'll do it all day. Hi, Sandra Berg. Good to see you. Ratiana Karaka. Oh, it's funny. You need hip stuff too. That's funny. So many people have had hip stuff. Oh, uh, 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 Peg. Um, I, wait, did I repost it? No, I don't think I reposted it. If you search for my username on TikTok, search my username, Tile Heels, and then search for virus. Ty L. Heels virus. And that tr transmission that you're going to find should assist with that. So just play it in the background while you rest, and it should assist. Washington State, about an hour north of Seattle, like Mount Vernon. It's my passion and my pleasure, Christina. Thank you for your donation. Your energetic exchange is deeply, deeply appreciated. And thank you to all my subscribers. Not my subscribers, our subscribers. I appreciate you so, so much. Um, it helps me immensely for a number of reasons. Um, not, not like just because of the energetic exchange. There's a number of reasons why it's really um, powerful and helpful. Um, energetically as well. There's, a, there's like a, there's things that happen when we do, we make connections and we share in things like contractual work. Not that it's like a contract. We, everything we inter interface with is contractual, but um, there's just some, it's good juju. It's just good stuff. Even as a just spillover, I had a profound effect from that last session. Beautiful. Congratulations, Isha Donai. Hey, Katrina. Good to see you, sister. Sure. Dobermans. Let's try something. You asked if you, we can help with um, anxiety. And if anybody needs some help with anxiety, I'm going to create a group hologram. Just intend that you want to receive. So I'm going to take a structure. And place it between the root and the, the crown so it's going up through your spinal column taking a cube placing a code in it i'm placing it around your heart that's inside of the cylinder and then i'm going to explode the cube and it's going to release the code that's going to go up and down and what's going to help you as well is if you identify where in your body you feel that anxiety most and feel it like lean into it so identify where in the body you feel it and feel into that area of the body, like focus, place your awareness onto that feeling. Like you're almost trying to make it worse, but don't try to make anything worse, but you're just leaning into it as much as possible. And then while you do that, at the same time, feel deeply into how your, your hands and your feet feel as well. Disney's upgrade. Why do I get that notification? I don't care about that. With pulp? What? How did I not see that? Whoops. I don't like it with pulp. <laughs> All right. We got one more. Kimbo is still in the house, I hope. Feeling tingling? <laughs> My husband helped coach your baseball team as a kid. What? Intergalactic Jessica? Interesting. How did you know that? And which one? I wonder what age. That'd be, that's pretty cool. I have a terrible memory. I don't remember anything. But, um... Oh, you're from Seizure Boy? <laughs> do I... Do we know each other? I mean, it's just not a big town. And you're intergalactic Jessica. I mean, come on. <laughs> you should uh, stop by the um, metaphysical fair this weekend. Saturday and Sunday. Um, I should be there. If the weather's not too bad, I should be there. But that's that's crazy. Go figure. That's really interesting. I guess that's the algorithm showing you people that are local. I've, I've had a lot of random people show up in my, my For You page, page and be like, I know, like people from high school and stuff. So that's awesome. That's cool. I'm glad that you mentioned that. Thank you. 
Yeah, this is what I do now. I'm a wizard. <laughs> a wizard with a bad memory sounds dubious. <laughs> That's it. It is. Oh, man, it sucks. I, I, I have to pull information from from the ether, <laughs> essentially. I have to channel everything because I'll forget, man. People that know me know I forget. Nope, I'm actually technically in Cedar Woolley, James, near Mount Vernon. All right, I think I'm about ready. What a joke. Yeah, Isn't a jo everything's a joke, Dr. Chels. Everything's a joke. If you, take, if you don't think it's a joke, you're taking life way too serious. You need to enlighten up a little bit. See what I did there? <laughs> I, I, honestly, the most, a lot of the, the, the wizards that I know that like, that do similar to what I do, technically have pretty bad memories as well. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I'll have to remember, I'll try, I'll try to remember that. But. Can it help with opening the third eye? Sure, I mean, you can, you're, when you use your imagination, you're using your third eye. Um, but I can always upgrade it for sure. Yeah, Benjamin, keep your awareness in your gut. We're gonna be doing a transmission here for someone specific, but there's always energetic spillover and the way that the light, this light works, these light codes, light is information, light is data. It's like a multi-dimensional package. It's like, it, it, it can be taken by each person uniquely. So it's, I like to use it, use the comparison of music because like music, you don't have to know what the person that wrote it intended when they wrote the song and performed the song to feel the emotion or to take it through your own filters to have an ex experience through yourself or to enjoy it right um and people may interpret the lyrics dramatically different it's it's kind of like that right so each person is going to get what they need because these are multi-dimensional like even in the matrix movies you see all that streaming code it's like that see how all of the, the little glyphs they don't stay solid right they're always switching and changing and moving and undulating that's how these things are they're multi-dimensional they're almost like little geometric versions of myself i saw that thank you yeah i'm not i can't remember i'm terrible about names and stuff so that's why i just got that out of the way because i wouldn't remember it. i don't remember any of my coaches i don't remember any honestly i forget a lot of my like close friends in high school's names and stuff like it's it's bad like it's bad, it's, it's, it gets bad. <laughs> so. Hey, good night, Fenrix. I appreciate that. If I seem cool, I'm, I'm happy with that. That's cool. All right, Kimbo, you're up next. And just as a reminder, um, you gave me a ride even? Oh man, I'll have to, I'll have to, dang it. Make sure you follow me. I'll have to make sure I follow. I wonder if I can follow from here. Oh, I can, oh wait, can I? I can. Go figure. Small world, right? I love that. <laughs> like anything's a coincidence. I, I'm way past that. I know nothing's a coincidence, which is fun. I love that. So just as a reminder, what I'm going to be doing is placing it on subscribers only when I'm doing the transmission. So if you want to be involved in the conversation that's going on while I do the transmission, um, definitely uh, take a look at that option and you get some other perks as well. So when we do group healings, I take in, um, intentions from the group people in the chat and, um, I'll be taking those intentions from those subscribers. And I'm not going to do that all the time. Um, but for the most part, I will be doing that. So if you want to support and show energetic exchange, that's a great way to do it. So I love you and I appreciate you. Thank you. All right. Sub only. Do, 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 do. All right, all right, Kimbo. And then I can answer a few more questions. And I got to get going at some point. Tuparna, Kayakura. Thank you for your subscription, Mikhail. Tuparte, Sandia, Karasu. All right, so we're just reaffirming no harm will be done. No energy will be taken. That is not freely given out of love. And it will be in alignment for the highest good of all only. We're doing healings, activations, upgrades, any combination of that that's appropriate for the recipient's highest good. Um, as delegated by her highest state of being, her highest mind, her higher self. Um, for for the highest good of her and the highest good of all only. We're going to reaffirm the connection to Mother Earth. A platinum frequency reconnect to Sirius. That hot pink frequency place the code in the heart. Inject the frequency from my heart into the code, into the heart, continuing to flow. Bring healing. Releasing clearing pyramids. I'm going to plug in the healing frequencies. Initiate the infinity through the system. Run that for an hour, run both of those for an hour. So we're gonna do a column cleanse. And then we're gonna do the healing code. 
Focusing on the heart. Welcome. You're welcome to guide that to a certain intention if you'd like. Otherwise, it's just going to go where it's needed most. And then we rock and roll. Uh, Since you mentioned hip, <laughs> we're just going to call in Libra into the hips and buttocks to assist while we're there. I'm going to plug in some frequencies, a number of different healing frequencies, a little thumb drive with a certain set of them plugged into each hip. Maratati. <laughs> Arda mu arda te yartia na 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 If you, feel, if you feel like your legs need to shake, allow them to shake and get some of that release, the somatic release. It's interesting that so many people have had hip stuff going on too, because I've even had hip stuff going on. I've had my hips reconstructed like six times too. <laughs> so it's a little it's new it's i don't usually feel pain or if, and have issues there it's not because of the surgery it's just because of my healing で、
confirm. Confirm. One. All right. Definitely have to let me know how you're feeling after that. When you feel ready. You're feeling after that. When you feel ready. Hopefully my connection wasn't crappy. Uh, Amanda says, wow, my whole left side got tingly. Beautiful. Great, great confirmation that the work was happening. And it, you, you don't have to feel things for it to be working as well. So just because, um, if you, for example, if you didn't feel anything, that's quite normal, especially when you are um, just getting introduced to this type of work because we will often have so many different layers of density on top of us. It makes it really hard to feel these subtle frequencies. Sometimes we have to attune to even knowing that there's subtle frequencies and what those feel like. We call it light linguistics, teacher Tina. Light languages, light linguistics. Um, it's just a universal expression of energy. So it gets expressed in different ways. People perceive it as languages, but it's a little bit more dynamic than that. It's more processed in the right hemisphere in the of the brain rather than the left. It's really meant to be felt through the heart. But um, so it's more intuitive. It's more meant to be known and felt rather than um, structured. It's not meant to like, it's meant outside of the boxes of languages that we are most aware of, right? Felt my arms get cold. That's a great sign. Great confirmation. Cold is great, especially after things are shifting. Hi, Amber. Good to see you again, sister. Okay, perfect. I only started glitching last confirm. Oh, thank you for that, Jessica. Uh, Divinely, Alexandria, we are... Okay. Um, we're done for today, but it, I change it each time. So it's d between, you know, like 27 to 33 or so usually. Beautiful. Because I felt tingles around my heart and I know I've had, have had heart issues. Well, great. Yeah, we did some stuff on the heart. So I would love to hear feedback over time how things are going for you. I was feeling pain in my ankle. Is this normal? Yeah. So Dizzy J, um, that's common. So I, sh I, I should remember to mention that. But sometimes if we have physical stuff going on, doing this type of work can inflame it a little bit. But not because it's a bad thing. Not like it's making it worse. It's inflaming because the energies are shoot like moving through that area. And it's trying to shift the energies. So it's actually a really good sign that there's energies moving through that, that stuck energy in that area. Um, so leaning into it will be really helpful. If you're open to the idea, I'll, I'll plug in some frequencies into your ankle if you're cool with that. I'm just going to hand it to your higher self to do if they want to. That's beautiful. Yeah, it's so cool. <laughs> Amber, you know Jessica too? How funny. I'm a track. Oh, thanks, Lizzie. You make me blush. It makes our awareness. Oops. It makes our awareness more available towards where it is needed, right? Uh, little Phoenix Fire, I'm not sure which you're referring to. I'm sorry. Princess, what's going on? We're just hanging out. We were doing some healing work for specific people. And I'm just about to get off here in a bit because I got a session I got to do and I got to make sure I'm grounded and cleared and, and rest a, a little bit before I have my session. But I love you all so much. Thank you to everybody who donated today that received. Um, I highly appreciate the energetic exchange and I appreciate y'all just being here and investing in your own healing and, and upgrades and all that stuff. The more that we heal ourselves, like that, that's the key. We don't really heal the world around us. What we do is we heal ourselves within and the world around us reflects that. So um, I appreciate y'all for, for putting in the work. And even those, those that are new to this stuff, I appreciate you for being open-minded and just hanging out. And you're going to be receiving if you're open to the idea and it's for your highest good. So um, it's awesome to connect with you. And if you have any questions, if anybody have, has questions at all, feel free to shoot me a message. You can, you can email me at my username at Gmail, or you can go into my bio and click on the thing in my bio, and you can send me a message directly through there. If you're interested in one-on-ones, I offer one-on-ones, so I, um, I really specialize in helping people to embody and integrate their higher selves. So the idea of the, the spiritual version of you, the, the more real version of you, the bigger version of you that's playing you in this, this container, 
um, you become more like that person. So you integrate more aspects of yourself and then a lot of things come with that. So obviously deeper healing and things like activation. So doing stuff similar to this and upgrades. So, you know, making your gifts stronger. Those are the things I essentially specialize in. But healing is my passion. I love healing. I love to do healing. I love to see results. That's, it's, I love that. I know what it's like to be in pain and to have physical stuff going on. So um, that's something I'm always open to assist with as well. So if you're interested in that stuff, check out my bio. The stuff in my bio is going to um, help you with that. Check out my page, follow my page because there's lots of free content on there. Um, if you're curious, if there's a transmission for stuff, search for it. Search my username and then put in, you know, something for it. You know, like <laughs> there's a ton of transmissions and honestly, a lot of them can be used for a lot of different things. But I appreciate y'all so, so much. Um, thank you to my subscribers. Deeply, deeply appreciate it. Um, it's a great way to show energetic support and have an energetic exchange. And everybody that's gifted, I appreciate you so much. This, it's just, you know, this is, this is what I do. I'm a wizard now, so every, every little bit of support helps. You know, this is what I do. <laughs> so uh, literally everything that you do makes a huge impact. Even just your love and the way that you interact with the lives and even just liking. The, there's so many ways to exchange energy. So I appreciate you so much. And thank you to the new subscribers. And thank you, Amanda. I appreciate that. I live liver horny. <laughs> That's good. Thank you for that. I love that name. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah. Oh, and one thing I want to mention too is that I have discounts, right? I have a special on pre-recorded transmissions. So I offer three different pre-recorded transmissions right now. So you can do a 30 second to one minute uh, video, like a like linguistics transmission to a song of your choice. Just make sure that you mention it in the notes and that it's available on TikTok. So that's why it's a 30 second to one minute. I'll, if whatever the clip is, you know, the highest, the longest clip I can get for it is what I will do. Um, I also do a version which is vocalizations plus the stuff. So I do the signing plus the vocalizations. So not really the music. Um, and then I do one that's a three minute version of that too. So you can have a three minute version, which is like a, it's like a transmission. They're designed for you to be able to use them over and over again. They're, de they're designed specifically for you. They're encoded specifically for you. And it's going to be what you need in that now moment by default for your highest good. But you can use your intentions and your imagination when you are receiving in order to have specific results. So if you want it to work on something specific, you can you know, place all your awareness in that area. Be involved with the process of healing yourself. Use your imagination, see it already healed. And, um, see yourself already having what you are trying to manifest and that'll make a big difference. So take a look in there and you can order through there. And um, yeah, that's it. I love you. I appreciate y'all so, so much. Uh, Thank you, Tina. Taraki is a retendant tumor, Mama Hatiara Kira. Would they suit in Bofarsna Hakaraki, Kirisi, Tatatat, Ingratasar, Daniana Kare, Haria Kuri, Marciana, Gusuria, Mantan and Okure, Tesha Taria Kare, Okure. That's the best uh, compliment ever. I live her horny. Thank you. I love y'all. Have a good night. I'll talk to you soon. Keep an eye out for, ne for more lives. Duara Nana. How do we get out of here? How do I stop it? There we go. Love you. Bye.